we highlight some of the uh, uh, areas. First of all, uh, at the Special European Council yesterday, President von der Leyen uh, presented additional measures that need to be taken by member states in order to have this better coordination, cooperation and solidarity for travel and for everything else. And this is why we highlighted as well uh, a strategy on testing and the rapid use of antigen tests, which we'll be coming forward with um, as soon as possible. But testing alone is, as I said, not enough. We need to have reliable data and smooth information flows us to be able to make uh, correct uh, decisions. Um, and this is the also impacts on having a common approach on travel. So I therefore um, urged, again, ministers to provide ECDC uh, with the speedy and accurate information of their epidemiological situation. This better coordination will bring, as Minister Spahn said, more trust and more predictability. And this is something we need to build upon. Having a vaccine itself is not going to solve the problem. Vaccination is going to solve the problem. So we need to have this level of transparency and to really send the message that we are not going to lower the bar in terms of safety um, uh, for, for, a, for a vaccine. Uh, and finally, I just wanted to highlight that on the 11th of November, uh, we will be presenting our first step towards a European Health Union. Um, presenting with stronger mandates for ECDC uh, and the European Medicines Agency in order to improve their crisis response capacity. And this, this I think, is out of crisis as this one, also come opportunities, and this is the start of a process for a more secure, a more prepared, a better prepared and a more resilient EU that really does do what citizens expect of us, to protect their health. So with that, I thank you for your attention, and I apologize about the technical difficulties, but this mm -hmm. comes with teleworking. Thank you.